Whenever someone uses the screen inside the security room, the cameras start blinking with a red light. You can notice it here. Keep an eye on these cameras, as they suggest that you're being monitored by someone. As soon as the crewmate goes away from the screen, the camera stops blinking. So if you're an imposter who's planning to finish someone, wait until the red light stops blinking. This means you're safe. Now, go and surprise your enemy. Just click on this screen once to skip this loading animation and enter into the game faster. You'll save a few seconds and can run away to take your position before others. An imposter can never do any real task. He can just pretend to do the tasks. So here are three animation-based tricks to find the imposter. Number one, if you're doing this task inside the weapons room, notice this fire animation every time you hit a target. So if you find someone doing this task, check for the animation. Real player. Imposter. Number two, this task in medbay has a unique animation. So if you see someone doing it, you can completely trust him as your crewmate. Number three, here's one more task below the storage area. Whenever someone does this task, a gate opens up to throw the garbage. So always keep in mind, these tasks can only be done by a genuine player and not by an imposter. Here's a good way to find the imposter. Whenever someone is doing a single task mission, keep an eye on the taskbar. If the bar increases, you can confirm that he's your crewmate. If the bar doesn't increase, you can easily predict that he's the imposter. While you're an imposter, if you find three to four players standing close to each other doing some task together, take advantage of this situation and finish one of them. Since the area was crowded, they can't clearly predict the imposter. It's not necessary to be very close to an enemy for finishing them. As soon as you come around an enemy, a red line appears around them. Hence, you can finish them from a fair distance. Now let's talk about sabotage. It's a feature only given to the imposter. Using Sabotage, you can close the gates of any area within the map by clicking on the cross mark of that area. Also, you can call for some emergency tasks by clicking on one of these. The reactor task requires two members to complete it. Also, the O2 task requires two members to complete it. Whereas, the electrical task requires only one member to complete it. If the crewmates fail to complete the emergency task within the given time, the imposter automatically wins the game. Vents are an easy way to escape or stay hidden. I made a vent chart to clearly describe all the vent positions and the possible directions to go from in each vent. Here's a 200 IQ trick you could use. Notice the camera blinking. That suggests someone is in the security. Now go to Med Bay and close the gate of the security room. Now use vents and finish your enemy. Here's a good trick to fool people. You can keep names of colors to confuse other players. Now when someone tries to vote you out, others get confused and vote out the guy whose color is the same as your name. So if you want to make the game really confusing, ask all your friends to change their name to the name of a color. The admin map is a very useful thing. Here's an example. Over here I can see two players on my left and three towards my right. Now watch carefully. A player from Medbay goes directly into the security, which means he used a vent. Now, as you saw, only one player is left and the other one has been finished. So I'll quickly run towards the security and see who that is. As soon as you see him, call for an emergency meeting and vote him out. Here's a fun trick. 
If you believe that someone is 100% not the imposter, stand next to him and align yourself. So when an imposter comes to finish one of you, he'd get a good surprise. Here's one more fun video. If you like these tricks and want a part two of the video, make sure to hit the subscribe button. Let's keep a like game of 100K. Hope you guys do it.